Hi there. In this screencast, I'll share how to embed a Google Slideshow in your Moodle course. Now, this is different than linking to a Google Doc or Google Slideshow in your Moodle course. This will actually embed the Slideshow so it plays directly on a page in your Moodle course. Let's go to the Slideshow we're going to be working on. In the File menu, down to Publish to the Web. And in that pop-up, look for the gray Embed and click that. There's some basic decisions to make here. I like to start with a small size because it will scale up easier than scaling down a slideshow that's too large for the page. Because a lot of students access Moodle, access your content on laptops and iPads and smaller devices. Decide how often to auto advance the slides. This is a decision regarding how much content on each slide to digest. So. I'm going to go with 15 seconds on this one just to see how it looks. Of course, a student can always pause the slideshow and advance and progress it as they need to. Decide whether to start the slideshow as soon as the player loads and whether to restart it after the last slide. Make those decisions and click Publish. There will be a little confirmation to go through. And then this copy right here. Go ahead and Command-C or Control-C that on your keyboard and then close the pop-up. And then to your Moodle course, you'll need to have editing turned on to be able to add the page. So up in the little gear down to turn editing on. Now this was the week five lecture, I believe. So in that section, I can click the add an activity or resource. Now down here in the resources category, the second from the bottom, page. Here's some descriptive copy and I'll click Add. And then the name field is what the, the link itself on your Moodle course will be called. Something like that. Not in this description field, but down to the page content field. That's where you're aiming for on this page resource type. But before you paste in that HTML, you need to get this field into HTML mode with a double bracket button right there. Now you can go ahead and paste. Now the default setting under appearance is in a pop-up. This is just a personal preference, but since this is a page that opens as part of your Moodle course, I'll go ahead and keep this opening in the same browser tab. And then I'll just click Save and Return to Course. And now I just test it out. and see how it plays. So I can progress. Well, we're not going to wait 15 seconds. We can go slide to slide to slide this way. We can also go slide to slide this way and choose our slides as we want. This is a neat feature. If you're going to deliver your lecture from this slide in your Moodle course, a little laser pointer to bring attention to your students visually. Turn that back off. You can go to full screen view right here and other options within this gear here. So pretty slick, pretty easy, straightforward. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.